Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Appetitos brand. This is an Aldi brand. Uh, we're going to be trying the bacon mac and cheese bites and the buffalo chicken mac and cheese bites. These were $3.99 each at Aldi. Uh, what you want to do is you bake these. So, we have preheated our oven to 400 degrees for both of them. We have a cookie sheet here. We have covered it uh, with uh, parchment paper. So, what you want to do... It says remove the product from packaging and place on a lined baking sheet in the center of the oven. So they come like this. Oh. And so these are the buffalo chicken. So I'm assuming you can just dump them out. Dump them out, yeah. Dump them out. And then I'll I'll um scatter them around a little bit and then these are the bacon so it's, it's hard to tell the difference it looks like the buffalo chicken if you um it looks like there's little pieces of black in there like some kind of seasoning and these the bacon they don't look like they have those pieces at all so they just look uh regular so what you want to do they they bake for the exact same amount of time 400 degrees and they're going to bake for 12 to 14 minutes. I will probably let them go the full 14 minutes, and then we'll be back. So this is how they look when they come out. They didn't leak at all. Um, so I was going to open, uh, open one up for you here. These are the buffalo chicken, and that's what they look like on the inside. You can see the, the macaroni and cheese. Let me, let me wipe off my knife. And so these are the bacon. And you see there's the macaroni. You can see a little piece of bacon. So now we'll take them over to the table and give them a try. Okay, we're going to try the bacon first. It says tender macaroni pieces, a creamy cheese sauce, and bits of bacon in a crispy panko crust. Four bites are 200. 30 calories, or you can eat the entire box for 700 calories. Which is Did as you bad eat as the one that was open? No. You oh, okay. Mm. Mm. You do get a, a touch of the bacon flavor in there. Mm -hmm. It needs a lot more bacon. Mm -hmm. You get a touch of that little smoky bacon flavor. I mean, but it's very, very light. Mm -hmm. and it really is. It's a really decent macaroni and cheese bite it's just not bacon right it has a little hint of a smokiness mm, to it what I get. but it's mainly just macaroni and cheese and you get the panko mm -hmm. these could have baked for probably uh another Two, minutes. well yeah if not five more minutes yeah. these are straight out of the oven just showed them to you we haven't let them cool off at all and you saw i popped that whole thing in my mouth because yeah. um it's warm it's not frozen. It's warm, yeah, but it's not hot. The outside's crispy, but it could be crisper. It could be crisper. Yeah. Definitely could be crisper. Yeah, literally, you just have to adjust your oven. But yeah, I think these could have baked a full five minutes longer. Yeah, At least the could. bacon. Now we'll yeah. see about these. This is buffalo chicken uh, mac and cheese, tender macaroni pieces, a creamy cheese sauce, and bits of buffalo chicken inside a crispy panko crust. Four bites are two hundred thirty calories. Is this the cooled off too? Oh yeah, yeah, it's fun. These are a little hotter, but not a lot hotter. Um, flavor-wise, the buffalo chicken is definitely has more flavor because mm -hmm. it's got like the buffalo sauce mixed all in the cheese. That's what I was gonna say about the the bacon one. If they'd taken a little bit of a smoke, like a liquid smoke, mm -hmm. and mix it in with the cheese, at least it would give you a little bit of that smoky flavor right. that it's missing. I like the buffalo one. I like the buffalo one better of the two. If you could only buy, if you only uh, had enough money to buy one, I would definitely recommend you buy a buffalo. Mm -hmm. It does have a little bit of a uh, spiciness to it that might, might make your tongue tingle just a little bit. 
but I think even if you if you can't handle a lot of heat, I still think you can handle that because it's not intense at all. No, it's not. If you didn't like hot food at all, then you might want to not get them. But if you can handle any heat, just a little. If you can I eat mean, a taco, you'd be fine with yeah, this. Yeah, <laughs> I mean it's just a little bitty bit, just a little, the littlest hint yeah. of a tingle. I don't think it's tongue. any spicier than a taco is. So. But I actually got a piece of chicken in mine. I, I may a, have. Okay. I got a little hunk of chicken, and you you got the macaroni, and it has that buffalo flavor. Mm -hmm. um, so I think those yeah, are. Really that's good. what makes the difference is that sauce. It's the mixed, sauce. Yeah. Now you could take the the bacon ones and dip it in something and add a little bit more flavor to it. You but could. For right now it's just a. It's kind of an okay macaroni and cheese bite. That's, right. That's all it is. And they do show bacon, and it, they just didn't put enough they bacon. Didn't put enough. But now the the chicken, they really did. They I, at least I got a hunk in mine. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, the, the buffalo chicken. These would be fun to serve for a party. I don't think anybody, nobody's gonna hate the bacon. No. They're just gonna wish it had more bacon. Yeah, exactly. They're they're good. They're just need a little more. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.